It's always a pleasure bringing your entertainment here on the AM show. Now, now stories as part of initiatives to boost tourism in the country and the continent. The Ministry of Tourism, Culture and Creative Arts is set to host World, uh, the World Tourism Forum Africa Summit come October 10, 2017. Speaking at a press briefing over the weekend, the sector minister, Catherine Ofeku, urged Ghanaians uh, to help support and create awareness about the summit. The three-day summit scheduled to start from October 10, 2017 at the Kempinski Gold Coast Hotel is expected to host 24 other countries, tourism ministers from other African countries, store operators, travel agencies, international media members, and also social media influencers to deliberate on issues vital for the continent's tourism growth. The forum will also provide the platform for participants to learn from one another to boost tourism in their respective countries and also highlights the investment gaps for the country. Speaking to Joy News, the sector minister said the conference is an opportunity for Ghana to sell herself to the outside world since the gathering will attract high-profile personalities from around the world. The World Tourism Forum will be hosted in Ghana for the first time in Africa. And we are looking forward to hosting international business leaders, global leaders in the tourism arena, uh, the Kempinski's, the St. Regis, the Four Seasons, leaders in the hospitality industry, arts, culture, will converge in Accra and discuss the next frontier, which is Africa, the next opportunity in the hospitality industry. Uh, the labor pool is in Africa. Uh, the people and the sites and the seas. Europe is done. Asia is done. Africa is the next frontier to build on our natural sites. So people are excited and they've never done this on the continent. They, they passed over South Africa, Kenya, Seychelles, Mauritius and chose Ghana. So we should be proud that we have been selected. It's because we have something to offer. The unique tapestry of our cultures, our, our ethnic and, and everything else that binds us together. But what is exciting them is really the kente cloth, the kente. So I am looking up to you, the media, to do the countdown to October 10th. The World Tourism Forum, according to a board member, Emery Kaliskan, is organized four times every year in global center around the world. He explains the need to bring it down to Ghana. I choose the Ghana because there is a huge potential for the tourism. But uh, if we organize this event here, we will promote also marketing with the uh, key people in the world wide. Because we are bringing the investors, we are bringing the travel bloggers, we are bringing the international media members. You can promote your country inside, in, in bond your country, but you cannot promote the outside. Because we are bringing all of them for the writing is something about the Ghana, for the uh, marketing of the destination. We are doing for that. The summit will provide networking opportunities for attendees and everyone is entreated to be part. That'll be all for entertainment here on the AM show. We'll bring you more entertainment in our subsequent bulletins. Oh, thank you very much. And you know, on Friday you play that song Despacito yeah. by Luis Fonsi. Yeah. And, you love uh, the song? Yeah, I've been playing this over the weekend. Okay, I traveled to Kumasi over the weekend and it was great just playing it on, in a car throughout the period. It's taking over. Yeah, it's got two point, over 2.7 billion, billion views. Billion views. I'm sure it's going to take over um, Colin Fett or is it, uh, what's the thing? Well, Wiz, he took Wiz over, oh, no, he took over uh, Justin Bieber. Right, you and know. he's going to take over from Gangnam Style and then Maybe Jay-Z as yeah. well. Oh, well, thank you very much, Becky. Okay.